you heard me talk about, I knew we'd probably see a tornado warning with this cell. And sure enough, a new tornado warning just issued for southwestern Mecklenburg County, northern York County into areas of Union County. Um, this is eerily similar track to the February 6th tornado of last year, um, which tracked from about the Carowinds exit, Pineville area, all the way to Matthews. It's a little bit further north of there. And let me uh, go to the radar full screen, guys. I want to show you the rotation. So there's the warning. Um, again, if you live in the path of the storm, get to shelter now. We were trying to give you the heads up before the warning was issued. Hopefully you called and texted your friends as we talked about, but I want to zoom in on the rotation itself. Um, there's Choate Circle. This is right near where Carowinds Boulevard uh, meets up with 49 there and 160 there just on the south side of town. So there's Hamilton Road, Shopton Road, Strong. That's the Rivergate um, Shopping Center right there in the middle of your screen. That's where the rotation is. Now, where is it going? It's pushing off to the east at about 35 miles per hour. So it's heading into uh, the Pineville area, eventually going to head over towards uh, areas near Charlotte Catholic High School, Quail Hollow Middle School, South Mech, um, um, basically Atrium Pineville area, um, just north of the, the Regent Park area. Um, as you cross the border, then it's going to move over towards uh, the Providence Road area, Carmel Country Club, down towards Providence um, High School, right along uh, you know, Pineville Matthews Road. That's kind of the track it's taking right now. So again, if you're listening to me on air, online, social media, wherever you are, and you know there's people that live in those areas, don't assume they know this is happening. Please shoot them a call, a text, a DM, whatever you, you can, because this is uh, heading towards the east. It also, just, just FYI, there's some large hail in there as well, so you're not going to want to be outside in this storm um, at all. I want to quickly pop up my camera uh, from South Charlotte. This is looking west. This is actually a camera on the roof of my house, and unfortunately, this storm is heading towards my house again, like last year, but you can see off towards the west there, that lowering, that's the area I'm looking for. So this is looking directly back towards Carowinds and um, Atrium Pineville, the hospital there. So that's the area that this camera is looking, and the area we're talking about is right there, moving into southern Mecklenburg County. So again, um, tornado warning for Mecklenburg Union and York. It's it's in that weird spot. And if you live in this, the northern tip of Lancaster County, you're under a warning too, um, even though it doesn't show it on the map. Disregard that, please, because um, that's another weather service office. The tornado does not stop at the county line. It is going in a straight line and it's heading basically right towards Pineville from the Rivergate area. Now, uh, meteorologist Chris Mulcahy, he, he's on this storm. I think he's traveling on 77, and I'm looking at your camera right now, Chris. I see the lowering. Is that the direction you're heading? Yeah, uh, Brad, we are looking right at it now. So we just pulled off on Tryon, so that was in from exit one on 485. So this is where it be all begins. So you can see the very front of the storm. We can't zoom in right now. It's that general lowering, and there's always going to be what's one part of the storm that we can refer to as the bear's cage. At that point, it's a bunch of rain. That's usually the hail core that's within that. But right now, if you head south on Tryon, you are seeing the beginning of that storm. So we're really close to those reds on the radar. Next stop is going to be those pinks. Those pinks are picking up on the hail core. A lot of times, if you watch some videos, big hail can come down as a proceeding before a tornado is possible. So we're about to drive. We're going to be very safe here. But you can see the leading edge of this, Brad, as it's working its way off towards the east at 35 miles per hour. The rain's starting to pick up. You never want to drive in this. We're going to try to be just on the outside to see exactly what is happening. It's anywhere right around the TK area. Pretty broad rotation right now, but you definitely see that this is a more serious storm. So there it is right now. If you're anywhere near here, this is the time that you have to be especially safe.